do this. Will there be a world record? In the semifinals? Yep. Welcome, Sports Nation, to Sports DTM, the sports channel where we call sports down the middle. You can expect the latest in sports news, views, and reviews from our resident analysts. No sports topic is too controversial, and no team or player is above criticism. So just smash that subscribe button and ring that notification bell to make sure you don't miss out on our balanced offering of riveting sports content. And don't forget to like, share, and leave a comment below. Welcome to Sports DTM. Great sports detail of undiluted sports content. Raymond and I are here to talk about the semi finals of the men's 60 meter at this World Indoor Championship in Glasgow, Scotland. We have one representative, and that is Akeem Blake, and he has advanced to the semi finals. So we're here to preview all three semifinals to look at the athletes that will advance to the final and get that medal. So Ray, um, we can go straight into it. Do feel? A long time the people have not seen you on, on Sports DTM. So you can say Happy New Year, Merry Christmas, the whole works. Yeah, yeah, um, season greetings. <laughs> so if we're to start with eat number one, and eat number one, features the American Christian Coleman, who looked extremely comfortable cruising, easing down to run the fastest time going coming into the semifinal at 6.49. Um, we think I'm going to make it out. I, I suppose Coleman is clear favorite um, to make it in this heat, um, the nearest person to him in terms of times from the heat, Larson, who ran a, a, almost a hundredth of a second slower. So Coleman can pretty much run, but drink some water and watch the others um, running after. Uh, yeah, Kirk, I, um, the truth is, this is just the race before the race, if you ask me, and um, into the finals. Respecting Coleman to meet up with Lyles and, and our own Blake and stuff like that. So of course, um, Coleman should come through this one comfortably. So I, I don't, I'm not seeing any upset here at all. So the the first two plus the two fastest losers will qualify for the final. So who you expect to make it through with Coleman? Well, Kirk, um, of course, if uh, outside of Coleman, I'm certain Larson to, to make a good show enough himself. So Larson could possibly push you into the into the finals. Um, and, and it's a toss up between anybody else. Uh, there's also a possibility of um, the Denmark runner making a good show in too. So, yeah, it's, it, it's a toss up for the rest of them. And I know it can be a blanket finish for them. Uh, persons are expected to actually push to their personal best and beyond in order to see themselves to the finals. All right. And if we go over to it, number two, which will feature Akeem Blake, it number two also has Emmanuel Eseme, who looked good in the in the um the eats as well. So we're, we're not expecting any upset here. Here again, Blake should advance easily. Yeah, Kurt. Um, Blake, of course, um, <coughs> did below um, 6.5 seconds comfortably over the years, so he should be able to advance. Uh, we're not expecting him to, to run sub 6.5 to make it to the finals given the competition, um, and so we are expecting him to cruise. So he should be one of the safer persons, true. Um, you had mentioned SMA. Um, he, he had done really, really well coming into this round. And so I'm also expecting him to be one of our favorites to get it, get to the next round. And of course, you can't discount. I mean, he ran a national, he ran a national record, SMA ran a national record to make it through to this round. As, as you mentioned as well, from Barbados, Burke, 
Yeah. 6.5 ET did to make it through. And there is uh, Volker, who is also there as one of the challengers. He did his season's best. I mean, it's 6.59. So yeah. you really don't expect yeah, it, 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 it should be very competitive. It should be very competitive for the minor pace. That's for and sure. And then it. And then for eight, number three. So I, I, I would want to think that the, the fastest losers will also come from this eight because in here from lane two to lane six, we have persons who were in the top eight based on season's best going into the world championship. You have Murray from Canada, Maniala from Kenya, Tada from Japan, and Noah Lyles, who is saying that the track is fast and he will get his gold medal and this will be in a new season's best time or world leader. Okay. Oh, yes, it is um, panning out. If, this, if there were any heat, you know, heat of death, it would be this one. Omaniala would probably expect to face Lyles into the finals. And so for seeing here, um, it should be it should be a very exciting one. Uh, I'm not expecting um Lyles to back down and I'll only I'll finish ahead of him in this one. So only I'll have to probably push, push really, really, you know, push a lot to actually stay close to Lyles in finishing this one. Of course, Tada, is it Tada of um of yeah. Japan? Yeah, he also were expecting him to, to have a good showing. And so I mean, he looked, he looked he looked comfortable. He looked comfortable in the eats. I mean, he ran up beside Omaniala and really look across to see if he, to see if he was there. Kind of shut it down and ran his national record at um, six point five two. Can we go to a limb here? I'm figuring this seat might help the fastest losers and as well as I'm looking for the seat to probably go below. 6.5 seconds. So this is going to be a sub 6.5 seconds um, heat. Has to be because these persons are not looking to back down at all. So there you have it, sports DTM fans. A quick look at the preview for the semifinals for the men's 60 meter at the World Indoor Athletics Championship in Glasgow. Let us know how you feel. Who are the eight persons who will advance to the finals? And leave all those comments in the comment section below. And always remember to like, to share, and to subscribe. And to tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend. And to come and join the Sports DTM family. Raymond and I signing out, saying, be blessed.